welcome back to Yazi Family Vlogs and Cooking. I don't want to look at Sue. Every time she looks at me, I just get nervous. I swear. <laughs> <Yeah. clears throat> so I was standing here with my eyes closed. So I just start sweating like crazy. So I said, quit looking at me. <laughs> she said this with the phone. Like, <laughs> Then that's when I stutter my words and I start messing up on all this and so I'm just nervous. Yeah, he gets nervous though when I look at him. <laughs> <laughs> See, I don't even know what I'm doing right now. <laughs> um, we're doing chicken tenders. Where's my sunglasses? <laughs> <laughs> we're doing chicken tenders so she don't see me. <laughs> this is four chicken breasts. I cut them up into strips. <laughs> I put um, a whole bottle of Louisiana hot sauce in there, three uh, two eggs. It's been marinating for about an hour and a half. Yeah. Then I got <clears throat> two cups of flour in here. I'm going to add a tablespoon of thyme. So thyme's going in. Or no, basil. Now it's thyme, see? See, <laughs> he's I need a drone. We need a new camera person. <laughs> I need a drone just to hover over me. <laughs> They're going to do white powder. White powder. <laughs> <laughs> white pepper. <laughs> We're going to do a whole tablespoon of white pepper. Now I'm out of white pepper. We're going to do onion powder. Josiah's ready. E, hold on, Jojo. Tablespoon of onion powder. Tablespoon of paprika and I'm out of garlic salt. So, like a tablespoon or here of regular kosher salt. I think you need to report that. And... He's nervous. Your mom's just making me sweaty. <laughs> so, we're going to mix this up. Got it under control. So all my chicken tenders, that there was four of them, so I cut them up into strips. And I'm just gonna put them in the flour. I'm not gonna use no batter. You can use a batter if you want. But I'm just gonna do flour. And then just coat them. And we're gonna put them in the oil. I learned how to do that from Shane Ballou. He told me that trick. Put it in away from you. Watch the spam video. He tells you, he tells you how. So shout out to Shane. The spam burgers. Safety first. So that's all you gotta do. Uh, I don't know, not quite overcrowded when my oil is just going to get cold. I think that's good enough. Yeah. So, we're going to for this one. Um, we're going to let that cook for about three minutes. Maybe even four. Okay. We're just going to let it cook in here. Uh, I'm gonna get it ready. So as you guys can see, it's cooking really good. You can smell it. The seasoning is really good. It cooks pretty quick because um, I'm just using chicken breast. And then how you can tell when chicken's also done. Deep frying is when it starts to float. So I'm just keeping an eye on it. The sizzle's nice. It's starting to float. 
been about three minutes now. Yeah. It's been about three minutes. Okay. And then you can also use um, cornflake salsa. Then if you want to make it even more spicier, you can add more spice to the flour mix on that side. That one's done. Is that one another minute? <coughs> Gotta reload. And that's all you do. Like um, this is gonna be quite a few pieces because I use um four chicken breasts, huh? They're a pretty big size. Yeah. And it keeps a lot, so this is good. This was supposed to be on part of our Super Bowl, but we didn't do this one. So try not to overcrowd your pan because your oil is going to cool down. And then it's just going to soak in there and it's just going to soak up all the grease. So this is how it looks once it's done. So that's all it is. It's really simple. I just had three chicken breasts. I cut them up. Then I put them in here. Um, this one is just two eggs and uh, I don't have any eggs. Okay. I have extra bottle in here. And that's what I used right there. I used the whole bottle. Poured the whole thing in there with the and then I mixed some with the eggs. And then just put it in the bag and I put it in the fridge for about an hour. Check it out, I got my flour right there. And then uh, four or five at a time. And this is how it looks right when it's done. See? And you can catch up ranch, honey mustard, barbecue sauce. And this is really, really, really simple. It's not dry. It's juicy. It's cooked all the way through. So the total cooking time was about six minutes, seven minutes. So as you guys can see, these ones are just about done. They're starting to float. This one's floating. The sign is ready to be picked up from work. He's going to come home to fresh tenders. Yeah, and I'm sure he's going to love his dinner. So, he may finish about five days and then maybe I'll let you watch me. And then uh, we'll have a taste tester here in a bit. Okay, people, we got the last part of the batch cooking right now. I think there's like five pieces in there. And that's how much it came out to. So with those 
four pieces of chicken breast that made a good amount of chicken tenders. And I think it's way cheaper than buying it from churches, yeah. Popeyes. You know, just making your own tenders is really cheap and, you know, for a pack of chicken breast that we bought was like eight dollars, right? Yeah. And there was like, what, six or seven pieces in there? There were seven. There was seven and we only used four pieces. I was going to use that. Oh. But, um, that's how the tenders look right now. And this is just regular flour breading with um, the seasonings I mentioned. I'll put all that in the description. And, you know, the marinade was just uh, the hot sauce and two eggs. So, after these ones are done, and then there'll be a tray full of like two, four, six, maybe like 20 pieces of tender. So that's a good amount of tenders with only four pieces of chicken breast. And other than that, it's, you know, you guys can eat it with that. You guys can have a side with it. You guys can make it as like a chicken strip sandwich, you know, put it in between a hamburger bun. So you guys can use whatever, whatever sauce you want, honey, mustard, barbecue, um, sweet and sour. Anything is good and Sue is going to be our taste tester. Yep. So, trying to keep you guys occupied. She's still walking around. I'm going to hurry. I don't know what to say now. Just watch this go off. Are okay with the making nervous? <laughs> You're taking forever. I'm trying to talk to these guys. They're not telling me questions. <laughs> <laughs> They're not asking me any questions. So she's going to go ahead and take a piece from there and dip it in her ranch and she'll let us know. Oh, you were waiting for me for that? Yeah, like 10 minutes. I don't know oh. what I was saying. I was ready to tell them about my, my school life from kindergarten to high school. How you met me? <laughs> <laughs> Almost went that far, but you finally came. <laughs> <laughs> Can you guys really wax down my aura and nervous? She just stares at me when I cook. I just feel uncomfortable. <laughs> I don't even know what to say sometimes. I'm just like, get yeah, show, look the other way. <laughs> I'm not even, well, I'm looking at him through the camera. Licking her lips. <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding. This is a PG show. <laughs> She's hungry for the food. <laughs> okay, here we go. Mm. It's juicy, not dry. It's juicy. You want to try a piece of air? Uh, your yeah. sister is creeping in the kitchen now. Yeah. Yeah. Grab it and you can dip it in your mouth. Salsa. I said, I want it honey mustard. Mm. See, that expression just gives it away right there. This pretty tastes like the ones that we have in the freezer. Tastes good? Yeah. Tastes Does better it? than the one in the freezer. Yeah. <laughs> this is not from the freezer, people. <laughs> <laughs> This is all homemade. Nevaeh has one from the freezer for her school snack, so. This one was made by Mr. Warren Yazi. <laughs> Nevaeh just tells me it's from the freezer. Mm. Good. It's not dry? Not dry. It's the spice to it. Very good, perfect. You like it, Nevaeh? Yes. So we'll try this recipe. Really simple, like I was saying, you know, only four pieces of chicken can get you all that right there, plus more. So this is, if you were to buy it at church, it'd be like 30 bucks. And it, I think it's a lot more fun making it at home too, so. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. It's fun cooking, and other than that, people, she's still chewing. 
these were delicious. So these ones are done, and then turn this one. Oh, Don't forget to mm. like, comment, subscribe, share, subscribe, subscribe, and look out for our next video. See you guys again. Bye. Peace. Bye.